I'll find those damn books. I hope you do. Doesn't bear thinking what would happen if people believe the bloody nonsense from those bastards. I don't want to find my blades pointed at me one day. Where should I look for those damn books? The Shadows wouldn't just trust their books to any fool. I believe you will find the majority of the books with certain influential people. The best thing is to look around here on Calador, and you will certainly find something in my native town Antigua. Visiting the mages will also do no harm. Where exactly am I supposed to look for books? All right. What do you need to know? Any idea where I should look on Calador? Well, if anyone knows, it will be Travis, the barkeeper. Or Yvette, the whore, in the tavern. I can't think of anyone else. from Mick's nightly strolls. Have you noticed anything unusual? Well, Brand the Butcher recently sent me a shipment of meat. I had to chuck a whole lot of it. It looked really fresh, but it tasted like pickled feet. Maybe you can ask around at his place and find out what was wrong with it. How's things on the farm? I generally say all is well, as long as we have something to eat. But when you get a sausage stuck in your throat, you know you're in trouble. Do you have a sausage stuck in your throat? Don't take it so literally. What's wrong with the meat? Usually I only deliver high quality products. But some of my wares have gone bad. It can't have anything to do with the processing. I did it the same way as usual. I think it's my servant's fault. But he played dumb when I confronted him. Do me a favor and talk to him. Maybe you'll find out more than I did. What is it? Just taking a look around. Go ahead. There will be no meat left by the time you're done, and I'll have to work even harder. But don't think you can fool me. I take it you don't care too much for strangers? No, I don't. Why should I? They hardly have two pennies to rub together, and if they have, they've not been earned through honest labor. Nah, keep me away from the whole lot of them. You should work on your attitude. Why should I? You can never trust a stranger, and that's that. So if you have no more questions, I have a lot to do. Bran says there's something wrong with the meat on your farm. <laughs> Bran also says that pig breeding is a wonderful thing. And I say it stinks to high heaven. If there's something wrong with the meat, he is to blame. He obviously doesn't understand his own trade anymore. And now shove off! Surely you have something better to do.
There's something rotten about this meat business. Well, there's no pulling the wool over your eyes. Look, this is a shit job, but I can't find a better one on this island. But this book has been a revelation to me. It made me realize I could get my own back by poisoning the meat. Show me the book you were talking about. Ah, you want to be enlightened too? Here, take a look. But bring it back to me soon. Which book? Well, the one I just... Wait! You tricked me! Give it back right now! I'll give you something else if you don't shut up. Hey, calm down. I just wanted to get some self-respect. Just leave me alone, okay? I will do my work diligently from now on, I promise. Here, take this gold. Not a word about it to Bran, okay? Who gave you that book? Hmm. I've never given that any thought. I've always had it. Somehow my memories are vague. The meat seems to be fine. Finally. I was worried I might have to start farming vegetables. Why was the meat ruined? Trust me, you don't want to know. Well, thanks for getting to the bottom of it. I've got to get back to work. I've got another sow to lead down the aisle. Go right ahead.